Jack Owens with ABI Attachments and here uh, with a customer just showing off the Gravel Rascal Pro. A lot of times on properties, just from the traffic, especially longer driveways that we have out in the country, they need a lot more attention than your just normal in-town drives. When I come onto a property, I'm always looking at the grade and seeing where the water is going to go and how do I get the water away from the traffic areas. So that's what I'm going to be doing is uh, kind of surveying and, and grading and moving the ground where it needs to be to take care of these problems. So what I first do with the Rascal is I'll have this rake all the way up out of play so nothing's getting bound because everything needs to be ripped. So I'll have the rippers usually in the second hole here and then I'll just go all around the driveway and just rip and break things up. So the rascal, I'm going down about two, three inches to rip things out, get it broken up so that I can backfill it again and try to raise it up, pack it down to where it's higher than those edges and the water has some place to go with the grade of the land. Now that the material is all broken up, the bottom of the potholes are ripped out. Now I'm using the rake to autofill. Uh, so taking your highs and filling the lows. So once I get the rake loaded up on these large holes, you have to drag a lot of material into them and just drop it off using the electric actuator. It's a lot easier than getting on and off, raising and lowering it. So the mud pit's pretty much full, but it's amazing how much material is actually here and it just needs redistributed. It didn't disappear, it's still there, it just needs moved around. But we've had so much rain and it's so soft, it needs to dry now. So let's say after uh, you know 24 hours a day of it drying, you can come back out with a rascal, stir more material up, leaving this alone, and bring more material in and build it back up and keep working it as it dries. But it's a whole lot cheaper than having more material brought in. So when we got to the driveway, we had to first use the rippers and rip in, rip out the potholes, rip out the, the trouble spots, uh, the ruts. And then after we got everything brought back up, ripped out, we used the rake aggressively straight up and down as a bot like a box grader to grab our highs, fill on the lows, and then taking the rake and putting them more at a, a slight angle to press down, to finish everything up. This has been a really wet season. Uh, a lot of agriculture's down and money's tight. The rascal can really save some money. I know around here, a uh, 20 ton of limestone costs around $500. Uh, this driveway would probably take about four trucks to do. So this rascal just got this driveway done using the existing material, saving a ton of money. Everything being damp and wet, it actually makes it easier to grade. So the, all the rain we've had this year is not all that bad. So we came onto this driveway, had a bunch of potholes, ruts, and mud, 
and now that's drying up might after it dries in another day or so do another pass and it'll look great <laughs>